क्लास नाइन एंड टेन स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू विमल सर जी यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन सी एक्सरसाइज सेवन पॉइंट वन मैंसुरेशन थर्ड पार्ट सिलेंडर एंड स्पीयर द क्वेश्चन नाइन सी इज द कॉप सरफेस एंड वॉल्यूम ऑफ अ सिलेंडर आर एट हंड्रेड एट्टी सी एम स्क्वायर एंड थ्री थाउजेंड एट्टी सी एम क्यूब रेस्पेक्टिवली फाइंड इट्स टोटल सरफेस एरिया सो द कॉप सरफेस एरिया द कॉप सरफेस मीन्स अगे दिस This is called core surface area. Okay, without this and this base. Okay, without this. Base. So core surface area. This is so core surface area. Now I'm going to write here the core surface. The core the core surface of cylinder. Okay. There is two value given. This and this respectively. Respectively meaning what? First value is curved surface area, and this second is volume. Okay. So curved surface area of cylinder is equal to given here eight hundred eighty cm square. And the formula for the curved surface area. This is the curved surface area. Okay. So curved surface area will be what? Suppose if I okay cut. This is our <coughs> cylinder. Okay, this is our cylinder. <coughs> Suppose, okay, let me okay one minute. I'll pause the video. Okay. Now you can see this. Okay, this is the what cylinder. Now curved surface area means okay. Uh, this outer surface area. Okay, this. Not this base and not this base. Okay. So suppose okay, if I cut from here. Okay, like this. Then it will get. Suppose if I cut from here, means okay, it is now cut. So this is now our cylinder. Okay. Now if I if I if I make it a straight, okay, like this, okay, plane, I will get what rectangle. I will get here this rectangle. I will get this rectangle. And this rectangle means first it was like this cylinder. Okay. This is now height. Okay. This is our height. That means this is our height, or you can say this is our air height. Okay, and this is now here our. Okay, this is our shape. Okay, well, this shape will be it. And this will be what? This is height, so this is our height, and this is our. What is this? <coughs> this is our. This is our circumference. Okay, circumference is what? Two pi r. Two pi r. So the curved surface area will be what? Length into breadth, breadth into breadth. This is length, and this is breadth, height. So two pi r h. This is what two pi r h. The curved surface area means two pi r h is equal to this is eight hundred eighty. Now two pi value twenty two by seven r value. R value we don't know. So keep it as it is. R value r and h. R value R and H okay keep it R and H R and H as it is okay is equal to eight hundred eighty. I will not solve now this part okay. I will give some space. I will now write here what volume volume of cylinder volume of cylinder will be how much volume of cylinder is given there three thousands. Eighty, okay, cm cube. And the volume of this cylinder will be what? Suppose if this is our, suppose if this is our cylinder, this is our cylinder, okay. In volume will be what? This cross section area into height, okay. This cross section area. This cross section area means the circular area. So circular area is what? Pi r square into h. This height is called volume, okay. So this is the formula for volume. This means pi r square minus h is equal to three zero eight zero. Can we get anything from here? Pi r h. So from here, what we get here? Suppose pi r h. If I split this like this again, this is pi r and h. Pi r h. Then two r so into r is equal to how much? Three zero eight zero. 
Now, now what we will do here? Pi R H value I will take from here. Okay, from here. So I will not. I will solve this like this now. Now I can write from here. Pi R H implies pi r h is equal to 880 and this 2 okay divided by this 2 so we got here how much pi r h is equal to 440 got it this is our equation 1 and now from there okay pi r h is equal to 440 i will put here okay pi r h 440 into r is equal to 3080 that is an from 1 pi r h is equal to how much 440 <coughs> now from here r is equal to how much 3080 divided by this 440 440 <coughs> 3080 <coughs> divided by 440 440 7 we got here 7 This implies R is equal to 7 cm. We got R equal to 7 cm. Now we can get, okay, there is to find, what is to find there? Find this total surface area, okay. The total surface area, we got R. So from 1, okay, find the value of H yes, from 1. From 1. From 1, what do we get here? Pi R H is equal to 440. <coughs> so 22 by 7 R value is how much? 7 into H is equal to 440. This 7 7 can see this much. This implies what? H is equal to this 440 divided by this 22. This implies H is equal to <coughs> 440, 440 divided by 22, 20, height is equal to 20 cm, cm right, and uh, this cm square is given, okay, so cm will be this, we got R and H, now we can find, find the total surface, therefore, <coughs> total surface area, total surface area, okay, what I told you, Lateral surface, okay, curved surface area. <coughs> this curved surface area. <coughs> this curved surface area plus curved surface area is what? 2 pi r h. 2 pi r h, okay, this is. <coughs> curved surface area 2 pi r h. This. And plus this circle and this circle. 2 circles in there, so 2 pi r h part. 2 pi r square or in language okay, I will write it in language uh, lateral surface area okay. lateral <coughs> cob surface area okay, called cob surface area or lateral surface area same okay in this case <coughs> cob surface area Lateral, okay. This is lateral surface area. Okay, outer. Lateral surface area, okay. Here, here is lateral surface area. That is also lateral surface area, okay. Curved surface area and lateral surface area same in this case, okay. <coughs> in cylinder case, both are same. So I write here. Curved surface area, okay. Curved surface area plus area of two circles. Curved surface area is how much? Two pi r h. Two pi r h plus area of two circles. So one circle is pi r h square and two circles are two. Now what do we do? We will take two pi and then r common. Okay, here is two pi r common. This is h plus. Plus, plus there is one R, okay. So one R I have to here now. Now we can see there is anything seems given. Directly we could use use this formula, but okay, I have the derivative. So two into pi is twenty-two by 
7 into r, r inverse 7 and your bracket gets 20 plus this is r, r inverse 7 7 so we cancel 22 plus the 44 into 20 into 7 27 is equal to <coughs> 44 into 27 1188 1188 1188 1188 11 and 88 this is the total surface area of cm square the answer in the book is 9c 9c 118 okay it is correct 118 cm square so dear students it matches with the book answer 1188 cm square there is only to find total surface area that we got okay so if you find this video useful, okay, share with your friends, okay. Sharing knowledge means increasing knowledge. Gyan life hai dinu sahi, gyan life baatnus. Hai man porcha man like garnus, comment garnus sahi. Man chahi na bani. Ispa saathi orle share garnus, ta paheko saathi orle. Heere ro humma garna. Hai sajil hoon sa bani. Ese ese exam mai dera mo magle hoon sa bani. Hai ta paheko yad garnus sahi, ta paheko. Lucky watching. See you in the next video. Radhe Radhe. Jai Sri Krishna.